this morning we're going to take a quick look at how to use one of these digital microscopes that we've picked up for the IMC with a Chromebook. And this is surprisingly easy. So we're going to just open the case and in the case we're going to find just the digital microscope. And it's got its cord attached right in so there's no way to lose these cords, which was part of the decision process for having these as a sign out piece of equipment for our teachers in this district. So I'm going to just slide this in and you'll see there's a little groove here and these screws in the stand are going to screw into that little ridge to hold the microscope firmly. So I'm just going to get it approximate and then I'll start screwing one of them until it kind of clicks in and then I'll just tighten it in but not too tight. So there we've got the microscope connected into the stand ready to use. Now it's just a standard USB for this particular microscope. Now if you did want to use it with an Android phone it does have this little mini in here as well but we're going to be using these with Chromebooks so I'm going to plug it into one of the USB ports on my Chromebook. If you have a Chromebook that does not have those USB ports, the old style USB, if it takes a USB-C do let me know because I have converters that will allow it to connect through USB-C which is a slightly smaller input. So it's connected in it's turned on its light right away as soon as we turned it on. Now, to use this, I'm just gonna go into my apps for my Chromebook. Let's close down the notification here. Go back into those apps. And I'm looking for the camera app that comes with the Chromebook. So, there we go. So this is the one that I'm looking for, the one called camera, and I'm gonna open that. And it's probably gonna to default to the webcam right off the bat. Okay, so sure enough, there I am. This little thing that looks like the refresh key, if I click on that, it's gonna switch the camera, and now I'm seeing what is in the microscope's view. And so if I start to do the focusing, there the microscope is tuned in onto the base of the microscope and if I want to take a picture of what I'm seeing under the microscope I can hit take photo. Personally I don't care for the metal so I would put a piece of white paper down before I got too crazy with looking at things under the microscope. So quick and easy that's how you connect your microscope in and then if you are looking for the pictures that it's taken Again, we'll go into our icons down here. And this time I want to go into my files because I'm going to find them in the downloads folder on a Chromebook. So there's the images that I have shot with my microscope. When I'm ready to put them into my Google Drive, whether I'm a student or a teacher, I'm gonna just come over here and I'm gonna drag these into whichever folder that I'm wanting to put these in on my Chromebook. So that's the long and the short of using the digital microscopes with a Chromebook.